verse 7. Lastly, verse 7 reads, Galatians chapter 4, verse 7. Therefore you are no longer a slave, but a son. And if a son, then an heir through God. Amen. If a son, then an heir through God. God is your father, and you inherit his blessing, which is eternal life in Jesus' name. Amen? Amen. Amen. Today, I pray that you'll have a deeper understanding of the doctrinal principles of how God has adopted you and chosen you, and why the scriptures say that he is your father. I don't know if you're out there. I don't know if you're here today, out there virtually, watching online today, a week from now, a month from now, or a year from now. Who could know your father except for God himself? I don't know if you've made that choice. The scripture says, until you choose Christ, that you are kept under the elemental things and your father is the devil. You can make that choice. You can be adopted by God. You can acknowledge your sin. Repent of your sin today. And God's not mad. And God loves us. If you're out there, if you want to be adopted into God's family and removed from the family of hate and placed in the family of love, you can begin that today, and I ask you to pray with me. I ask you to receive Christ right now in your heart. Pray with me. Dear God, I know that I am a sinner. I want to turn from my sins, and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ is your Son. I believe he died for my sins and that you raised him to life. I want to receive him into my heart and to allow him to take control of my life. I want to trust Jesus as my Savior and follow him as my Lord from this day forward. Please, God, fill me with your Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Let that be your beginning. Let that be your beginning of your adoption to the family of God. We're going to have a couple of minutes of meditation. And then Doug will come up for our closing. We'll have a little song and a blessing. I ask you to leave here today refreshed. Thank God for the blessing of his word. Medit just meditate, clear your heart, thank him, speak to him, pray to him, tell him you love him, give him anything that's on your heart that you don't want anymore. We'll take a couple of minutes and then Doug will close us out. Thank you.